Good morning, drumming community! It's 8.30 a.m. I'm on my way to the Drum Technique Academy office and today is gonna be a great day. Quote for the day is smile your drumming. <laughs> That's the title of a drum book written by Emmanuel Caplete. I'm butchering your name Emmanuel, I'm sorry. This book is about hand technique and stickings, rudiments and so on. I've been following Emmanuel for quite some time now. She's an amazing drummer from Canada. And the big question today is, you know, I'm not checking out the book for my hand technique. I bought it because of my foot technique. So basically I want to test today if it's possible to use that book as a practice tool to work on my double bass skills. So there's gonna be a lot of starting and stopping double bass and also the Sorry. Also left foot lead, which is not that easy. So we're gonna test that one. Usually I'm a right foot lead drummer. So it's gonna be interesting. The book itself, you know, I bought the digital version. I printed it out, you know, and yeah. That's what we're gonna do today. Man, what a money good man. Da, 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 da. And today I'm gonna be using my Pearl Eliminator belt drive pedals. So no direct drive today. Also no super cheap Millennium pedal today. Just gonna use the regular Pearl Eliminator. Wait here, I can show you the book. That's the cover, that's Emmanuel. Cool thing about the digital version of this book is Emmanuel, you know, recorded a video for each pattern. So actually then you can see her demonstrate the pattern at slow, mid and up tempos. And of course, as you all know, you know, as a metal drummer, you always want to work on the fast stuff. So if she's playing fast today, I'm going to try to at least match her maximum tempo with hands, with my feet. I'm back in my ghetto, 22nd district, Vienna. And now I'm looking for a parking spot. <laughs> There's one right here. Did you see that? That's a small parking spot, kind of. Okay, we're gonna try to get in there. Me and my limited driving skills. Close call, close call. <laughs> Not that easy. Alrighty. Alrighty, drumming community. So I'm back at the Drum Seek Academy office. While I was preparing today in the morning at home for the, today's video, I already checked out the complete book. So here it is again, Emmanuel Caplete. Please don't contact me asking if I can send you the PDF. Just buy it. It's, it's not that expensive. Actually, it's really cheap and you get a lot of value out of this one. Support her. She's amazing and amazing drummer and this book is awesome. In the beginning, the first couple of pages of this book are more focused on dynamic exercises. So crescendo and decrescendo exercises for your hands. Not that interesting right now with me for the feet, you know, for the double bass drumming stuff, but for each exercise, exercise there's also a demonstration video included so I'm gonna show you this one for the exercise I'm gonna practice I'm gonna work on that one and I'm gonna practice it at slow medium and up tempos all right so for this exercise she's demonstrating it at 60 80 100 bpm 120 and 140 let's listen to the 120 bpm version real quick right hand lead left hand lead Right hand lead, left hand lead again. Awesome. Okay, so uh, switching between right hand lead and left hand lead, basic eighth note triplet and sixteenth note triplet exercise. I'm gonna work on that one on the practice pads. I already know that the left foot lead is gonna cause a problem, but let's check it out and let's see how far we can take it. 
Alrighty, so let's do this. Let's start at an extremely slow tempo, like recommended in the book. We're gonna start at 60 beats per minute. A six tablet endurance exercise. To be honest, the biggest challenge for me is starting that long double bass pattern with the left foot. So this one. One, two, three, four. Getting that one down tight is a bit difficult, but let's see what happens. 120 beats per minute. Right foot lead is easy, but leading with the left foot not that easy. But again, as metal drummers, you know, we love to push our limits. So although this is not perfect and not really stable or performed that well, let's increase the tempo to 150 and let's see what happens. All right. Alrighty, so not a perfect take at 150 BPM, especially when I'm leaning with the left foot, but we're getting there. So to finish this video, let's try 160 beats per minute. Alrighty, at 160 BPM it became kind of untied, so not really happy with that one. One other thing that I found out is that as soon as I start to focus on leading with the left foot, I kind of tend to rush, I tend to start a bit too early for each pattern. So be aware of that one, I'm not really super happy with that one, especially since I'm kind of rushing. That's enough for today, but at least I got something to work on. Alrighty, done for today. Amazing book by Emanuel Capletta. So smile your drumming, go check that one out. We're gonna link it below. For me personally, I'm gonna spend more time working with this book. I've already seen that leading with the left foot is one of my weak spots. We are using the ankle technique. It's like bouncing a basketball up and down. So the bass from beta is the basketball in this metaphor. So you're bouncing the basketball up and down. When you're playing double bass, it's like got to bounce two basketballs with right and left hand or right and left foot. Actually at the same time, but you want them to hit the floor or the bass drum head one after another and if you switch that around and start leading with the left foot it's even more difficult still got a lot to improve right here but actually also kind of challenging and a lot of fun to work on something new so on something fresh so looking forward to that one alrighty drumming community that's it for today's video leave a like if you like this video don't forget to subscribe to our channel it would mean a lot to me if you want to work on your double bass drumming skills then make sure to sign up for our free double bass masterclass link is also below in the description wish you a great day cheers from vienna bye bye